set in Ireland during the early 1980s, The Quiet Girl focuses on a young withdrawn girl who is sent away one summer, leaving her dysfunctional family behind to live with her distant relatives. Over this time, she forges a close bond with her extended family as they embark on a sort of healing journey together. Well, here, Aaron Galling, so. Shasamach, good out of my splay, the character. And worker, she laid you a house and home. Oh, don't we all eat in spurts, same as we grow? We keep the child gladly. The film is based on Claire Keegan's 2010 short story Foster, which was adapted for the screen by the director Colin Barade. Having previously worked on documentaries and short films prior to this project, this is Barade's feature film debut. Language is an important feature of this film. The production team decided to opt out of hiring a casting director to assist with the budget restraints, but also because they were concerned a casting director might not have the ear for the Irish language. Neil. Neil. The slight use of cinematic score and diegetic soundscape grounds the film in realism. Despite its overall quietness, the sound design is carefully curated. An example of this is the call of the cuckoo heard during the opening and closing credit sequences. Not only does this transport the viewer to the acoustics of the countryside, but subtly mirrors the film's narrative as this species of bird is known for laying its eggs in other birds' nests in order to raise their young for them. The cinematographer, Kate McClue, decided to shoot in the Academy aspect ratio, allowing for a lot more height in the frame. This aspect, although standard in the early years of cinema, is rarely used nowadays, with filmmakers mostly favouring wider aspect ratios. The film broke box office records upon its theatrical release and became the highest grossing Irish language film of all time. The director, Colin Braid, went to the Irish Film and TV Awards, expecting to be beaten by Belfast. In the end, The Quiet Girl walked away with eight out of the ten awards it was nominated for, including Best Film. Let us know what you think of The Quiet Girl, and don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.